Hey guys and welcome back to another Unreal Engine 4 tutorial. In today's video it's going to be a nice, quick and simple one and we're going to be going over how to slow down and speed up audio within the game. So this is going to be very simple, so let me hit play and show you what we're going to make. So very simply if I press 1, 2 and 3, 1 is normal speed, 2 is slowed down, 3 is sped up. So let me go through those now. So as you heard there, we had them all at different speeds, it sounded quite good and we also have a lot of customization on how slow or fast they do go and I'm just using these start content sounds to do this. So let me quit this and I'll show you how I've done it. So to do this is actually very simple and all we need to change is one thing and that's the pitch. Now I know what you're thinking, that just changes the pitch, it doesn't actually affect the speed. However I have tested it and timed it each time and changing the pitch does also actually affect the speed within Unreal Engine for some reason. I'm not entirely sure why, but I guess the way they determine changing the pitch is by actually also changing the speed of the sound instead of just changing the pitch. So that's something nice and simple which we're going to do today. So I have these three sounds here, again with the start content, claps 1, claps 2 and my claps Q just to actually play a random one here. So what I'm going to do is select all these and duplicate them. So I'm going to have the first one as a reference to the normal sound and the second one as a reference to the slowed down speed. So I'm going to hit enter to open all of these up here, let me make this a bit bigger. Now in the claps queue here, all I want to do is just change over the sound effects so it's going to be playing the correct ones. So that just wants to be my new collapse sound effects here. Let me just change those over like so. Now if we can save and close that, and now we have our sound waves open. So I've got them both open at the same time, as you see it says two sound waves up at the top, that's because I open them both together like this. And that's good for me because I want them to have the same pitch. So here we have pitch, we just want to change it. The lower the value, the slower it will be, the higher the value, the quicker it will be. So I'm going to change this one to 0.1 and it should probably go to 0.125 as you can see there. We'll save that and that will now be a lot slower. I'm going to close this and I'm going to duplicate it again. So select the original ones, right click, duplicate and do the exact same process. So open them up change these ones over in the sound queue and also you don't need to do this sound queue method as well if you're not using a sound queue this is just for the purpose of the tutorial so I can show you it working. Save that and I'm going to change these as well. So this one I want to be quicker so I'm going to increase the pitch and I'm going to increase this one to 2. So we've gone 0.125 as the slow version, 1 as the normal version and 2 as the quick version. So we'll save and close that like so. So now we have all of our sound cues here for slow, normal and fast. I'm just going to be playing these in my third person character blueprint just so I can show you it working in game as well instead of just in the engine here. So I'm going to open up my character from content, third person BP, blueprints and third person character and in here you can see I've already got, on pressing 1, 2 and 3 I'm going to be playing a sound. 1 is my normal sound, 2 is my new sound which should just be collapse Q2 and 3 will be Collapse Q3, as you see here. So we'll compile, save, and hit play to test it out. So again, it should be normal, slow, quick. So as you can hear, that works perfectly. So I think that'll probably be it for this video, as we don't have anything to do, we've set it up so we can slow down and speed up audio with Unreal Engine based upon the pitch, so the lower the pitch, the slower it'll be, the higher the pitch, the quicker it'll be. And I do also have another video which I'll link down below on actually slowing down and increasing the time in game as well. So thanks so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed and I hope you found it helpful, and if you did, make sure to like and subscribe down below. So thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.